Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you guys three amazing Chromebook tips to speed up your workflow and just make using a Chromebook a lot easier. So let's get into the video. Now the first tip that I'm going to show you is to enable tap dragging and tap clicking. Now turning on tap clicking and dragging definitely would make using your Chromebook a lot easier because you wouldn't have to like click down on the mouse pad. You would just have to tap it. Also, dragging while holding down the mouse pad is a pain in the butt because you hurt your finger doing the most basic things, such as changing sliders and moving windows around. Now to turn tap dragging and clicking on, what you gotta do is go to your settings, scroll down to touchpad, and then turn on enable tap dragging and clicking. Now tip number two is learning how to switch to a different tab faster. How most people will switch to the other tab is just bring your mouse cursor up to the tab and then click on that tab, which is the less efficient way. But on Chromebook, you can actually take your three fingers and then swipe it across the trackpad to go to a different tab. The further you swipe left or right, the more tabs you swipe across. And tip number three is grouping tabs together. So, if you have a ton of tabs open, it would be, uh, you know, nice to sort of compress them into one tiny button that you can click on, and then all your tabs would show up. Well, you can actually do that in Google Chrome, and I think in other br browsers too. To do that, you can bring your cursor up to one of the tabs, right-click on a tab, and then select Add Tab to New Group. And then, only one of your tabs would be in this one group, so to bring more tabs into that group, you just bring a tab, go in into that group and then boom and then if you want to close that group you can just click on the little button right there and then it will immediately compress them don't worry your tabs are still there you just got to click on the button again and then you can see the tabs and you can actually have as many tabs in that group as you want now if you don't want that group anymore you can just right click on that group and then hit close group so yeah i really really hope you enjoyed this nice short quick video if you loved it please subscribe and i'm gonna see you guys in the next video bye